News in 60 is supported by El Pato Fresh Mexican Restaurants. We're expecting to learn more today about a deadly shooting that happened at Mission Regional Medical Center. Two people killed in what authorities are calling a murder-suicide. It all started around 2 p.m. yesterday. According to police, a hospital employee was supposed to meet her current boyfriend and her ex-husband in the parking lot. But that's when the situation turned deadly. Police say the ex-husband shot the boyfriend and then shot himself in front of the ex-wife. We'll be sure to update you as we get more information. This morning, a DPS trooper stationed in the valley charged with drug trafficking. According to a criminal complaint, Trooper Pablo Talavera Jr. was arrested last Thursday. He's accused of escorting loads of money and drugs on behalf of his father's alleged drug trafficking operation. A pre-trial hearing has been set for November 9th at the McAllen Federal Courthouse. And happening now, open enrollment for health insurance. You can either sign up, add, or drop your coverage. But there are some changes this year. The deadline to enroll is now January 15th. But if you sign up after December 15th, the coverage won't kick in until February 1st. For free assistance, go to healthcare.gov. You can find help there in both English and Spanish. And turning now to weather, the heavy rain from last night is continuing to move away. But we may see a few light showers today. Highs will be in the 60s. That's your News in 60. Have a great day. News in 60 is supported by El Pato Fresh Mexican Restaurants.